That would have been a better plan. <laughs> Guys, did you hear the news about camp? The rat infestation isn't exactly news. It's just part of the rustic experience. <laughs> I always liked the rats. They never gave me a wedgie. A nasty case of hemorrhagic fever, but no wedgie. <laughs> no, Camp Bohawk burnt down. What? Oh my gosh, what happened? Apparently a camper wanted a really well done s'more. And, well, got it. <laughs> this stinks. Now the camp is canceled, I'm stuck spending the next two weeks in this palatial mansion. <laughs> Beachy, I have your morning smoothie. <laughs> Got to garnish. <laughs> I'm not really in the mood for a meatball smoothie. <laughs> Kept Bohawk burnt to the ground. I feel for those poor campers. Darcy, you care about others? I just know how much joy the Bromowitzes get out of giving you wedgie. <laughs> I'm hating seeing you so devastated. <laughs> if you can't go to camp, perhaps the camp could come to you. I, I guess we could have the camp here. We could be the counselors and give the kids the full experience. Oh, and I can be one of the campers. I've always dreamt of living in a shoe. He's going to be really disappointed when he finds out what camping is. This is great. Camp Bohawk is back. Just promise me you won't invite the Abramowitzes. Too late. They're on their way. Hey, Harper, want some popcorn? Fresh melted butter. You're drinking butter. Now, this way, my hands don't get greasy. Pretty smart, huh? Dad, what are you doing? Oh. I'm writing something really important, and it has to be done by tomorrow. Oh, if it's for school, how important can it be? It's not for school. It's my final appeal to the Harvard Admission Board. I'm drafting a 17-page letter refuting the letter they sent me. Leave us alone. <laughs> oh. Don't worry, I got another pound and a half simmering on the stove. I'm not worried about your butter. I'm worried about my paper. <sighs> Harper! <laughs> your paper. order. I think that's hard. You should try drinking nachos. I mean, the cheese comes out fine, but these chips are playing hard to get. Dad, this may be the concussion talking, but could you help me type this letter? I'd be happy to help you type a letter. So, which letter are we talking? I know most of them. <laughs> Sorry, 
replacing all 200 mattresses in my guest room with ultra soft pillow tops. <laughs> oh, time to hit the wood. Are you sure it is being safe to sleep out here? Totally. Trust me, the only time I felt safe at camp was inside the cabin. <laughs> to type for you. I can't believe I agreed to this. Relax. I have lots of computer experience. How do you turn this thing on? <laughs> okay, just type what I say. Dear Harvard. The gist. What do you mean the gist? I just said, dear Harvard. I bruised it up for you. Bruised? Sure, made it more memorable. Anyone who reads that is definitely not going to forget it. <laughs> How many peas in hippopotamus? What? There is no need for that word. Ah, I'll just guess. Let's say 12. OK, no, 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 stop it. You're done. You're done. Delete it. Fine. Hey, I'm just trying to help. If you want me to delete it, I will. Is it gone? Sure is. Hit send, which sends it to the delete folder. I'm worried you guys aren't getting the spirit of the whole camp thing. And since last night was such a disaster... A disaster for you? Sleeping on those pillow beds is better than sleeping in a shoe. <laughs> well, I have no idea what you're saying. I know you guys aren't getting the Bohawk experience. Can you speed things along? The girls and I are getting mani petties. <laughs> there are no mani petties at Camp Bohawk. <laughs> All right, today is survival day. We will be learning how to live off the land in my bedroom. <laughs> I will be showing you two different kinds of wild berries. One is safe to eat. The other is extremely poisonous. Knowing the difference could save your life. Save my life! <laughs> Murray, what are you doing? The Abramowitzes made me play dress up all night long. <laughs> and the worst part is, I look fabulous. <laughs> your mascara's running, sweetie. <laughs> Murray, sit down. And don't forget to cross your legs. <laughs> and trafe berries, just remember this little song. If it's a trafe, then you're safe. If it's a hosin, get to the hospital. 
hospital immediately. <laughs> so, treeps are sweet. Well, hosens are... Uh-oh. <laughs> Don't worry. One of the four doctors I saw assured me I'm fine. <laughs> so we can continue with survival day. Uh... <laughs> My eardrums are pretty swollen, but I think I heard some cheers. <laughs> Counsel at Asi. <laughs> All those years of DJing has done a number on my cubicles. I was thinking green would be really cute, but not a heather green, more like a. What is going on in here? That's the color. <laughs> you would look fantastic with Richie's face on your nails. <laughs> I'm really disappointed in you guys. Richie, here's the deal nobody's into the whole camp thing. You're making too many rules, and everybody just wants to have fun. Yeah, Richie. These are two piggies went to the market, and they all came home with the smiles on their faces. <laughs> this is not what we do at camp. <laughs> Come on, everyone. Let's go craft with pine cones. Uh... <laughs> Any chance they're going to collect their own pine cones? None at all. <laughs> okay, campers, who's ready to have some bellhawk fun? <laughs> I am, and thanks for being the best camp leader ever. <laughs> you, you, you. Have you ever seen him like this? No. What a rapid five-minute descent into madness. <laughs> Richie, I need to talk to you. Anything you need to say to me, you can say in front of them. Listen, I know you're upset because the campers left, but... you kept making them do stuff they didn't want to do. But they didn't do a single Bohawk activity. But they weren't at Camp Bohawk. They were at the coolest house in the world, and you were showing them snails. When you have your own personal water park, nobody cares about your snail. <laughs> I guess I was just trying to give them the experience we had. Right. And what was the number one rule at Camp Bohawk? Never go in the shower without flip-flops. <laughs> okay, what was rule number two? Always have fun. Exactly. And snails aren't fun, Richie. They're just not. Ask anyone. Even the pine cones will tell you. <laughs> She's right. <laughs> And nothing says thank you like a brand new credit card. I guess when I think back, the best times at Camp Bohawk weren't doing what was planned. They were... The clay fight we got into in ceramics? That was awesome. I was gonna say the water fights we got into when there was a heat wave. Amazing! <laughs> Wait, I have an idea. Does it involve the pine cones? Yes. <laughs> But my backup plan doesn't. Then let's go with the backup plan. <laughs> Email from Harvard? Oh, no. <laughs> Upon reading your letter, we've decided Harvard is the best place for you.
Excuse me, Harper Rich. Harper just got into Harvard Rich? <laughs> Who are you? I'm Dr. Wright hyphen Islandfeld from Harvard. Oh, you got here fast. Well, it's a pleasure to meet you. I can't wait to study at Harvard. Oh, sweetie, you're not studying at Harvard. Harvard is studying you. <laughs> Th there must be some mistake. <laughs> we read your letter. There's no mistake. Grab her, boys. <laughs> Dad, do something! I am so proud, honey. <laughs> Hang on, before you take her, let me take a picture. <laughs> uh, congratulations, Harp. You're always going to remember this moment. I'm afraid she won't have any memory after the experiments we're doing on her. <laughs> Please don't take me to Harvard. Please. On behalf of Harvard and the medical community at large, thank you for letting us have her. I'm just happy I could help make her dreams come true. <laughs> Just high five. Take that! And that! Revenge is a dish best served with a side of meatballs! Murray! Murray stop! I'm done! I'm done! You can let me go. I'm cool. Take that! <laughs> Who's laughing now? A promo at Sam Eat! I'm cool. I'm cool. <laughs> you did it, Richie. You created memories of a lifetime for those kids. And one fully grown sweet. By the way, Richie, if you want to the market, we are the meatballs. I was going to say milk. But yeah, meatballs too. Thanks, Darcy. You were right. This is way more fun than snails. <laughs> A meatball fight. 